So I want to go over how to use the calculator on this problem. Uh, the key here is find the probability that at least six of them use their smartphones in a meeting class. So in the answer before it, it might have been exactly six. So what you are doing is the exactly six. The at least six means six, seven, eight, or nine. So if you go to the question help and you go to stat crunch, this is going to be the calculator we can use here. And we go to, um, I'm going to pop it out in a different window just to make it a little easier to manipulate with. But I'm going to go to stats and I'm going to go to calculator and I'm going to go to binomial. This is the um, calculator that's going to calculate everything we're given here. Um, you can do standard or in between. So this said at least six. So what's the probability that it's going to be greater than or equal to six? So you're going to have a drop down here. Um, X is six here. N in our case was nine. And the probability was 0.49. So just kind of going back to the question real quick. The probability P would be 0.49. If nine adult smartphone users were randomly selected, so that tells us nine are in the population that was randomly selected. And here we want to find the probability that at least six of them use their smartphones. So what this calculator is going to calculate here is compute. It's going to give us our, our answer, and what it's doing is the probability at six plus the probability at 7, plus the probability at 8, plus the probability at 9. You were probably calculating the probability x equals 6. You would have had it done the probability x equals 6, plus the probability x equals 7, plus the probability x equals 8, plus the probability x equals 9. And if we compute all them, you add all those numbers together, you'll get your answer. But here, the calculator allows us to do the probability that the x is greater than or equal to 6. And that comes from the at least 6. And that gives us the answer there. So you hopefully can see where that came from. If you have any other questions, please let me know.